Hey guys, it's Derry, Sinna Witch Carpenter from the Rainbow Witch's Colorful Cottage. Again, sorry about the weird angle. I'm trying to, I'm still trying to maneuver this camera arm. Um, but I am here because I have been working like a crazy dog today on my Book of Shadows. Or, or in my case, my Book of Wicked Rainbows. I know you guys are probably all sick of hearing about that, but... Anyway, I'm going to break it down for you and take you on a little book of book of shadows or book of wicked rainbows tour. So, here is my book. And as you can see, it is Wizard of Oz themed because when I got this, I was really into my wicked the musical kick. I was listening to the musical, I was reading the book. I was just kind of we had just gotten the Great and Powerful Oz DVD, so we were kind of all in a Wizard of Oz thing, so, but I created this. This was a birthday gift. It was just a plain, plain brown book, and as you can see, I filled up quite a bit, but I've still got quite a bit to go, um, but I have created this book, and there is Alphaba, or the Wicked Witch of the West, and it says, I do not make commotions. I am one, and then you've got Glinda and a flying monkey. And then on the back, we've got all the little stills from the Wizard of Oz movie. It says, thanks for the memories. But here we go. Um, okay. This is a little, just a, a folder. It's got some stuff in it. But there's a book blessing. Um, there is, this is my Christian Pagan or Christian Witches beliefs and um my my pagan journey here is the principles of paganism that i adhere to there is my wheel of the year and the moon phases i i didn't realize it that i had this in the beginning so i added so there's two there's two moon phases in my book so but that's okay so but there's just one of my spells there's another one of my spell pages this is for the winter solstice. This was for Yule. This is for the winter solstice. There's a um, bonfire. There's a fire spell. This is a wonderful, endearing poem that was created for me by my dear friend. It's Derry, my fairy god, my fairy god Derry, and this was created for me by my very dear friend Angie or Alley Cat and the Black Hat over on YouTube. So go check her out. Um, if I think about it, I'll put her link down below. Um, but yeah, there's my, my wheels of the year, which I haven't finished. So we're just going to kind of skip over those. Those are my sabbats, which I obviously haven't finished writing. But yeah, those are my, and then there's one of my color pages that says, keep your heart open. And this was created by, um, Molly Brown, aka Her Speak, Molly on her speak so um but this is my um stuff on the goddess morrigan yeah so yep and there's some of my spell pages this is from most of my spell pages if i don't create them they come from um amy Cesari's coloring book of shadows which is where a lot of these come from so but yeah there's some more that I've done and I've gotten a lot of crap over oh well you can't dress a wire you use coloring pages that makes you a fake witch no it doesn't you do what your heart feels called to do um and as you know I love the rainbow so I will put my rainbow spin on everything um but there's the days of the sun and there's the days of the week I put the days of the weekend upside down <laughs> I just now realized that but, oh well, that makes that, that just makes it unique. There's some more moon phases. There's the pentacle. Um, this is my memorial page, um, because cardinals represent loved ones that have passed on. And it has a list of the four people in my life that have passed, that have meant a lot to me. Um, which is my grandmother who passed, Granny Bird passed in 1988. My best friend Brad died in 1990. 
My grandma died in 1991. My mom passed in 19 in 2005, and my dad passed last year. So, um, and there's another one of my spell pages. This is actually a recipe. This is for my Serenity incense. Um, there's a, a home protection sachet. This is another fire spell. Um, so, there's the Hamsa. There's a mandala, and that's it for right now. And I've got plenty more. I've got a stack here of stuff that I'm going to be adding into here. So, but as I add more, I will take you on this journey. Um, as you can see, I've got my, my truth altar over here, which I took you on a tour of the other day. Yeah, there's my Morrigan altar out there in the hallway back there. Um, but yeah, so there you go. That's just my extra jars and extra art supplies and things like that. So if anybody has any questions, um, I highly, highly, highly recommend getting, if you can't draw and definitely subscribing to, um, Molly over at her speak, I Definitely recommend subscribing to her YouTube, her Patreon, because of her Patreon, you can get um, some of her color pages. She did an actual Book of Shadows coloring book. Um, I highly recommend Amy Cesari's books, the coloring Book of Shadows books. I've got all of her books. I've got some of them on PDF. Um, so, but as I can't draw, that's kind of why I tend to use color pages and I can put my own colorful spin on them, but I hope that helped and everybody have a great night and I will talk to you guys later. Bye guys.